Well, the newest national polling has some bad news for President Trump. He's facing record high disapproval ratings, while the Russia investigation and Robert Mueller have strong support. But WBZ political analyst John Keller finds an even more troubling sign for the president in that polling. John? Yeah, Liam, it's the accelerating backlash against the president by the voter group that has dominated every presidential election since 1980 and promises to be a key block in the upcoming midterms. Women. Factories are reopening. Jobs are pouring back into the United States. You can quarrel with some of the president's claims, but one thing is beyond dispute. The economy is humming with record low unemployment. And while this Indiana rally featured plenty of female Trump fans, outside the hall, a new poll shows they're in short supply. The Washington Post ABC poll finds men disapprove of the president's job performance by a 54 to 42 percent margin, but among women, his support Support has cratered with an eye popping 66% disapproving, while only 30% approve, a 24% gender gap. That's double the gap afflicting Mr. Trump during his first year in office, and more than triple the gender gap suffered by the last Republican president, George W. Bush, at a comparable point in his first term. Female voter behavior has often been tied to the economy. So, with boom times here, why are women? still so widely anti-Trump? That new poll shows an even starker gender gap over the president's handling of the economy. Men approve of his work by a 15-point margin, but a solid majority of women disapprove. Why? One in three rows of beans in Missouri go to China. Whether it's concerns over fallout from White House trade policies or findings like the 64% of women who think a crime occurred when Mr. Trump allegedly directed his lawyer to pay off women who claimed they had affairs with him, the president's relationship with female voters is heading south fast. Now, the gender gap in the last presidential race was the widest ever, Liam, but it stood to reason, at least to me, that the new president had a chance to make up ground with sure. women, but so far, that's not happening. Despite that gender gap in 2016, President Trump won among white women. Right. Is he seeing erosion among that group as well? Yeah, those numbers are eroding across the board. I've never seen a gender gap like this, and I'm not sure there's much you can do to turn it around. Maybe one thing would be, uh, a little bit of contrition when some of these scandals pop up, but that doesn't seem to be in his makeup. John Keller, thank you very much. We have